Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're going to talk about yet another hidden feature that you can encounter in the build 25267, the latest build from the dev channel of the Windows Insider program. And this feature is a smaller one, but I think it's a useful one for a lot of you guys. And I'm going to show you how to enable it. And it's related to the File Explorer and the Context menu. More info about that, of course, in the following minutes. Before starting the video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the Tech Based channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this. One. Before starting the video, a quick message from our video sponsor. This video is sponsored by KeysFan.com. KeysFan offers cheap and legal Windows Office and software licenses with big discounts in the month of December. For example, you can get the Windows 10 Pro license for just $10 by using the coupon code TB50 and you can also upgrade for free to Windows 11. By using the coupon code TB50, you can also get Windows 11 Pro for just $13. Office licenses have even a better discount with 62% off by using the coupon code TB62. Check out the great prices from keysfan.com in the links from the description below and don't forget to apply the coupon codes. Thank you to keysfan.com for the sponsorship. Let's continue with the video. A big shout out to Phantom Motion 3 for discovering this hidden feature, so go ahead and follow him on his Twitter. So to enable this new hidden feature from the dev channel, of course you'll need to have Vive Tool set up on your computer. Just go ahead and download Vive Tool from the article below in the video's description. Make sure to download the latest version .zip. Once downloaded, you can open it up with File Explorer and then click on Extract All. Then on Browse, locate the System32 location in this PC, Local Disk C, Windows, and then just scroll down to System32. Select it, click on Select Fuller, Extract have to replace the files in this nation click on continue a few times and then we should be good to go for those of you wondering why i'm doing this in every video in which i show you how to enable hidden features well a lot of people a lot of new people are watching the channel and i prefer to do this in every video because it just doesn't take up a lot of time once we have vive tool set up we just open up the cmd open up the search box type in here cmd click on run as administrator and on user account control click on yes we're going to have to run this command next which is vive tool slash enable slash id 39696859 and if you receive the message successfully set feature configuration, you can just close out the CMD and restart your computer as it is recommended for the changes to take effect. After the restart, you can open up the file explorer and in the navigation pane of the file explorer, you'll notice that if you right click on any of these items, you will have the old context menu enabled by default. I think this can be useful for some people that prefer the old context menu. I think this is a great way in which we can do that. I'm not sure where this is going. I mean, Microsoft is maybe trying trying to give us an alternative. Maybe they will give us an option to switch between the old or the new context menu. Because in my opinion, this show more options button is pretty much not that useful. I think they could just implement or redesign the old context menu to have all the other options when you right click as easy as that. Because even though it will take a lot more space because this is bigger, I think it will be better because a lot of people complained about the new context menu. Even on the desktop, as you can see, we have pretty much the same options if we click on show more options so I don't think it is necessary to have a hidden context menu or hidden old context menu under a button. Let me know in the comments below if you think this hidden ID and this hidden feature is useful and of course let me know in the comments below what you would want to see in the future videos. Don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from Techbase until next time have a nice day.